So my name is Wesley Barnett. I work in the International Games Division here at the United States Olympic Committee. And today we're at the Ted Stevens Sports Services Center here in Colorado Springs. Uh, the facility itself is here to help the athletes prepare uh, to be their best at the games. As you can see, the facility is something that's very inspirational for the athletes as well as something that's very functional for them. When you walk into this place, you can't help but feel excited and feel motivated uh, by what you see around you. Uh, the world-class, high-quality equipment that's here, uh, and then the trainers and the uh, other professionals here at the U.S. Olympic Committee that help take the athletes through their routines uh, to get them ready for the games. It's something that we are very, very fortunate to have here uh, at our facility. So the way the facility came together, we had lots of sponsors that contributed to the overall construction of the building. But all the equipment that you see behind us, uh, that was provided by our wonderful sponsors at 24 Hour Fitness. All of the world class, high quality, high impactful equipment and machines uh, that the athletes use on a daily basis. Uh, this is one of the main things that helps the athlete uh, continue to stay fit, continue to stay healthy, and helps them prepare for ultimately uh, their biggest performance of their lives at the Olympic Games. So we have a wide variety of equipment and facilities here actually within this facility. Uh, we've got dumbbells, we've got strength equipment, we have cardio equipment. We also have a lot of turf that goes from the inside uh, to the outside where athletes can do plyometrics, they can do sprint workouts. Uh, so really it's an all-encompassing facility uh, and a one-stop shop for the athletes uh, who are preparing for the Olympic and Paralympic Games to come here and do what they need to do uh, to be ready to perform at their best. So one final thing that I'll point out is none of this could be possible without the support of our sponsors uh, and those individuals in the country that support our sponsors. Uh, this is all done by private donations, this is all done by individuals who uh, make contributions to the U.S. Olympic Committee and to all of our wonderful sponsors. So it's one of those things that uh, we really like to hold true uh, to the saying, America doesn't send its athletes to the Olympic Games, Americans do. 